God bless you, my beloved. Thank you for joining us today. We are Abundant Grace Church, and I'm Bishop Ramon Di Maria, and I'm the senior pastor of the church. For prayer or information concerning our ministry, please email me at abundant.grace at att.net. Our message title today is The Witness. I will be reading from the book of Romans, chapter 8, and verse 16. The Spirit itself beareth witness with our spirit that we are the children of God. Beloved, as Christians, we are never to get into the spirit of bartering with God for something. We will never have the witness of God until we have done all that he tells us to do. You may be wondering, why doesn't God reveal himself to me? Well, he cannot. It is not that he will not, but he cannot, because you are blocking him as long as you will not abandon all things for him and give him all of your cares and burdens. The moment that you abandon all things, and give them to Jesus, God will witness to his own spirit that dwells in you. If you are concerned as to whether God can deliver you from sin, either let him do it or tell him he cannot. A scripture to always remember is Matthew chapter 11 and verse 28, come unto me. And Luke chapter 11 and verse 13, come if you are weary and heavy laden. So my beloved, ask of God if you know that you are being entrapped with evil ways, that you can't shake, and he will deliver you. But be truthful with him, and admit that you are in bondage to these certain things, and through Jesus Christ you will be delivered. The Holy Spirit witnesses to the redemption of our Savior and Lord Jesus Christ. He does not witness to anything else. He cannot witness to our witness. The simplicity that comes from our natural common sense decisions is apt to be mistaken for the witness of the Holy Spirit. But the Holy Spirit witnesses only to his own nature and to the work of redemption through Jesus Christ, never to our reason. If we attempt to make the Holy Spirit witness to our reason, it is no wonder we are in darkness and perplexity. Beloved, get rid of your cares and burdens and cast them at the foot of the cross of Jesus Christ. And he will give you the witness of the Holy Spirit, which comes through the redemption of your soul through Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. Let us pray. Father God, in Jesus' name, we come to you giving all our cares and burdens to you. We are weary and heavy laden from carrying these things, and we want to give them to you that we may be set free from the weight of sin. Continue to convict us of our sins and lead us and guide us down the right path, which is to eternal life and victory. Thank you, Father, for being with us today as we pray in the name of our Savior and Lord Jesus Christ, to whom be glory, power, and majesty now and forever. Amen. My beloved, if you want God to bless you, allow the witness of the Holy Spirit to work in you and through you, through our Savior and Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you and have a great week.